Oh, y'all hold. Um, it's 8.55. I'm gonna go to the gym. I've been in and out of sleep. I did wake up at 5.30. I did start studying kanji, but not enough for me to memorize everything. So, you know, it is what it is, right? It is what it is. <laughs> um, yeah, here we are. Second to last day of school for me. It's my finals day. Um, tomorrow's just presentations, but I really don't care about them. So today's my final day. Yeah. 856. I'm going to go to the gym. Go work out my back. Um, I studied. I did the best I could. It is what it is. It doesn't matter. It's only one class that transfers for credit anyways. Everything else, fuck all. So... Let's go to the gym. Bye bye. My camera lens is just a little bit, little bit condensated or some shit. I don't know. Can't clean it very well right now. I don't think it's adjusting well, but this is second to last time in this gym. Once again, here's the gym. Today we are doing back. So I'm doing this first. I'm going to stretch. Um, I don't know if I will be recording exercises because people are probably coming, but yeah. Ooh, ew, why are these shoes wet? Oh, hell no. Nah. Mm -mm. Oh, hell no. Nah. This is nasty. Oh, hell no. Nah. That is nasty, folks. That is nasty. Why are them shoes wet? Nasty. Yaho, we are finished. It is 9.30. Um, it's a little bit of a shorter workout today. Ooh, big ass dragonfly. Um, it's a little bit of a shorter workout today just because I still have some, what's it called? Some studying that I want to get done before my first exam, like the actual most important exam, the one that like counts for my major when I transfer back. So I need to do well on this one. Um, there's like, two reading sections and a listening section that I just want to quickly like take a glimpse at to refresh my mind. Did I get enough sleep? Probably not. Um, but hopefully I do well enough today. I won't lie. I'm just aiming, I'm aiming for a 50% because it appears that each time I take a test, my first test I was the most prepared, the most I get is a 50%. So hopefully Today, I just get a 50%. That's all I want. It's humbling. It's humbling out here. But we better get back to the dorm. I'll see y'all. Bye-bye. Now, hello everyone. I'm Gigi. I got ready. I did my skincare. I'm freaking out a little bit, but it's okay. Um, new AAU shirt that I bought doing this very, very quickly um, but yeah so about 20 minutes before 19 minutes before I leave for class and it's just like crazy to me that I'm about to be done high key I do want to eat a bagel before but I'm kind of lazy to warm it up and also I just feel like I don't have enough time but I'm gonna try to quickly warm up the bagel and then listen to this. So, I'll see y'all later. Bye bye. It's my final time being in this classroom. C303, it's been real. For me, I'm out of this bit. Yo, ho. Ima. Duty is 40分。あの、試験は難しい。難しかった。とっても難しかった。at first I was like yeah I'm feeling good you know what I'm saying I'm feeling good right boom first page I'm chilling I'm chilling first page boom second page it's not that bad I'm like okay I understand these concepts I flip reading I'm cooked I'm cooked 
I was so cooked on that part. So not not the best. Not not the best. I will not lie. It was not not the best result for me. She was she was kinda tough. She was kinda tough, I won't lie, she was kinda tough. But damn it, I gotta order food and I'm gonna study again. Cause I got more fucking homework and tests. I hate this shit. I hate this shit. Oh my god. I fucking hate school. Okay, V, I'd like to ask you, you know, we were just talking. What what uh what was the question that you asked me? Just wonder if anyone have asked you if you're gay. And and I wanted to ask why why do you ask that question? I know, like I did wonder a bit. Like I mean like you have like a look of bisexual, I don't know why. What the fuck? Like not gay, but right? <laughs> What the fuck? What the fuck? Like maybe like your style? No? My clothing style? What's what's my style if not clothing style? Like sometimes I find your outfit kind of like a bit girly. Mm. 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 Yeah. Like it was like a soft boy, but like mm. Mm. I feel like most of the time I just wear like, baggy clothes. No? Do I not? Really? Okay. Out the way bar. Example. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Like, is this gay? Is this bi? Does this give bi? I am the one in the middle. No, no, maybe not this outfit. Maybe not this outfit. Okay, maybe not this outfit. Not this outfit, no? Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Is this outfit? Is this no, outfit bi? No. Okay. All right, I'm gonna show you the photo. This is me. This is me. Nothing wrong with bi people. Nothing wrong with the LGBT community. It's there just a I'm a supporter. One. It's just not me. There's at least one. Yeah, there was at least one. Was it this one? A bit. Yeah, at least a bit. Yeah. But isn't this how Japanese people dress? No. What do you mean, nah? Is it just because I have my belt like that? No, right? Don't ja Japanese people seen. always tuck in their their shirts. Like tucking their shirt? Final? Eh? There's no way. I I see so many people tucking their shirt. But like that's not why you look gay in this outfit. Why do I look gay in this outfit? I don't know, in general. <laughs> no. 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 Nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. It's just just that's just personally that's just not me but if this defines as gay or bisexual no, by bi, if this is bisexual then I don't know I'm not gonna say I'm bisexual but I, I just dress like this like very elegant, you know? elegant okay okay let's see what else is this gay the outfit itself doesn't make you look gay but how you pose Okay. <laughs> so you're telling me I'm supposed to look? I just, I just put, no. I put baggy pants. I just wear baggy pants. I just wear bag. This is, this is, this is bisexual. This is, this is no homosexual outfit. Just look that homosexual. So it's just me. I myself. The vibe. The vibe. The vibe. vibe. The vibe. Yo, boy. So you okay. So it's just me. Like my energy itself gives you that that okay. Well sometimes. That sometimes. <laughs> That's crazy. I could not beat the gay allegations in Denver. I cannot beat the gay allegations in Japan. I'm cooked. <laughs> That's a Japanese class. Japanese class. Yo, ima, shit. Ah, yo, ba. Ano, 
晩ご飯食べました。食べます。食べます。はい、はい。はい。It's the last time. One of the last times we'll be able to do this. What you got today? I got a hot and spicy, as you can see. Okay. I got some chicken nuggets, small french fries, and I got a pasta. Mm. <laughs> and he fucking that shit up. Mm. I got the same thing, just no chicken on the side. Badass. Yo, Bali just pulled up. Bali just pulled up with the grub. This is actually my dinner. This was actually my lunch. So, Bali just pulled up. Chef, could you Hi. run us through uh, what, what you made here? <laughs> yes, sorry for all the saran wrap. I couldn't find my lids. <laughs> So this is um, like fake pickled cucumbers. Um, I put like lemon juice and black pepper, habanero, um, and then adobo on it. Adobo? Yeah. Mm, you got I, you got look, uh, Caribbean people use adobo. We don't use salt. I mean, we use salt sometimes, but that's all. I don't use salt, so this is what I use. Um, and then we have oh, kimchi ramen. I'm no. <laughs> Um, yeah, you have kimchi ramen that I made. Uh, you need help? You need help, SD? Okay. <laughs> yeah, so uh, the, in the ramen, I have uh, some sliced smoked chicken and uh, I put some. Sorry, I triple wrapped that shit. I didn't want to spill it on you. Um, <laughs> damn near. Um, and then I put some green onions on top. I also put green onions in here. I hope you don't like. Dislike them, um, yeah. I hope you like it. Okay, good, good, good. I worked hard on it, so I hope you like it. <laughs> when the steam coming up. Hi. Oh, no problem. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we got the pico cucumber. Do you eat it separately or you put it in the ramen? Um, oh, I, I, whatever you like. Yeah. What do you, how did you eat it? I eat it as a side dish. Okay. Hear that? Here's that pickled cucumber. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Get I need you to it. focus, man. I need you to focus, little bruh. Please. Please. Why, why won't you focus? <laughs> you don't love me? Oh, it is focusing. My bad. I'm just tweaking. Okay, here you go. Itadakimasu. <laughs> that boy, mm. that boy is good. It got a little kick to it, don't it? That's, a, that's fire. You like it? That, is, Yay. that shit is fire. I love fermented food, so it's like, it's add a little bit in here. Okay, next we got that ramen. Mm -hmm. Oh, we even got that, that spoon. Mm. Spoon coming in. Damn, this spoon, it got like a feel of like a sonic spoon. <laughs> how you know, how I know that? I'm fat. I'm fat. <laughs> Sonic spoons are long. That's crazy, bro. Right? That is crazy. Damn. <laughs> damn, I'm fat. What the <laughs> fuck? Okay, we're gonna try the broth first. Ooh, mm hmm. I spiced that shit up. Mm hmm. Oh, you got me right. Yeah. Oh, you got me right. All right. <laughs> Might have the nudes. Okay. Get to, get to. It's a little hot. I know. <laughs> Fresh off the stove, baby. Ooh, off the stove? Mm -hmm. Oh, you know who I should have done for my presentation? Mm, that's fire. Yummy. I should have done a famous actor. You know, from the US. You're so multi talented. You know, if none of your careers work out, <laughs> you know, fall back on this bit. Arigato. Because this should go. Mm. I love to cook. He's a famous so actor. This should go, this should go crazy. So this should go crazy. You gotta try it with the chicken, though. I got you. I got you. You got your egg. Mm -hmm. I got everything. I look fat as a bitch. I look fat as a bitch. Okay. I'm so glad. Okay. Let me blow on this bit. Oh. Oh. Did I hit you? Did I hit you? Oh, no. Did I hit you? I don't know what got my eyes. <laughs> my bad, bro. I just blew a mark. I blew Mark. I'm so sorry, Mark. Don't hit my eye. 
Mm. You know, mm. You can't see already. Mm -hmm. The chicken has a good flavor, right? Mm -hmm. All right, guys, this is a five out of five. This is a 10 out of 10. This should got my approval. So I came with the fellas. <laughs> hey, hey, show, show your thing, show your dance. Hey, hey, hit him with, hit him with a dance, hit him with a dance. Hey, you know me, I got the, the fucking fat one. I got the... <laughs> Shout out to Bali for the food. I'm gonna go stupid on this bitch. Oh, she got me chocolate. Yes, of course. I can yeah, she got me chocolate. They got me chocolate. They got me chocolate. It's about to go crazy. That's love. That's love. Yeah, they got me chocolate, bro. It's about to go crazy. Come on, fuck it. <laughs> bro, <it's> <laughs> I had some peanut butter. He said, I'm going to get rid of this peanut butter. I said, me, me, me. He said, he said, he said, baby, I'll keep it. I said, damn it. Our last one's got it. Our last one's got it. Our last one's got it. I'm going to try. Oh, this Bye bye. Mina Yaho Ima Gozen Niji Ipun des. It's 2 01 a.m. I'm very tired. And I was recording and I realized my microphone wasn't even working. And that is so heartbreaking because I was yapping for seven minutes. Um, so we're going to quickly speed run what I just talked about. After my test, packed up some more, packed Okinawa. Then got dinner with Mark and then Bali pulled up, brought out that delicious ass, you know, the ramen, the pickled cucumbers, smoked chicken, shit was fire. I won't lie, I felt big back as fuck, but it was so good. Um, and then after that, what else? Mark and I went to the gym, we did leg day, and then we had basketball, it was super sad. Um, we just scrimmaged and it was really sad saying goodbye to everyone. I'm gonna miss Dice Book Club a lot. I really do care for all the people there. They're such great, amazing people. Um, I really will miss you all. And it's really surreal that right now, today is the last day at AIU, so it's like, damn, whoa. <laughs> well, I mean, I come back for Kanto Matsuri, but it's like, last day is, you know, you say. I'm not, I'm not a student anymore after today. I'm just, I don't know, I'm just here, I'm just a foreigner. But after basketball, it was really sad. You know, I don't want to say bye to these people, but I will have to. Um, and that's just part of life. It's just how it goes. And it's really, really sad, but I'm really happy to make the connections and meet the people that I met. After basketball, Will and I went to go bike around. We were biking around AAU campus, you know, talking about, you know, the moon, the stars. It was so romantic. Oh, really people, I love you. It was so beautiful. It's always beautiful at AIU. And we're talking about clubs, and we're like, okay, we just keep going in circles. Let's just go into the park. So we're in the park, and this is where we see like a tiny, not tiny, dog size, small to mid-range, small, more small, small dog size animal, um, furry animal, black furry animal, scurry across the road. Let's just chill in the road, like, not the road, like the bike path, we're like a path, right? Chilling in the road, and then, or chilling in the bike path, and then it, it's like sitting down or something, I don't know, sitting down, and then it like, moves away, right, when we get close, you know, light flashing and shining on it, it runs into like a bush or something, um, and we're like, what was that? Raccoon, bear cub, we don't know. And so I was talking about, oh, I'm gonna miss you so much, and I really am, I'm gonna miss you so much, even though I was slaving away, I'm gonna miss it, not the slaving away part, just the people, the environment. It's a really good experience, EK Ken. Um, and then, I was like, damn, I really want to go to this camping ground that's really close to AIU, just check out the stars and the moon. And we was like, oh, let's go. And so we're biking, we have Google Maps, and we're turning onto like this bike path that goes across a bridge. And like one is terrifying because you know pitch black. But on this bridge, there's like these machines that play noise, like dog barking, human yelling, um, and then like fireworks and like gunshots. And so we pass it, we get jump scared because I think it I'm not sure how it works, whether it detects on motion or detects on like weight. I assume it'd be weight. Just because if like a squirrel went past, it wouldn't like go off on the squirrel, right? Or a bird flew by, I don't know. Don't worry, just my thought. Um, anyways, we're going down this path, straight out of a horror movie, horror game. It's so terrifying. Um, one imaginary like figure in my head pops up on the path, I'm done, I'm cooked, I'm crying, I'm jumping off the bridge. Um, and so it was very scary, and you know, we're already scared from the machine because it's like playing noise while we're biking through the path. Like, no, nah. it was like, let's just turn around. And we're biking across the bridge, and we're trying to pick up pace because, like, oh my god, like, it was so scary. What if we just turn around as a bear? And we bike for another five minutes, and we get to the main road, and we're, you know, we're making our way back to AIU campus, and we're just talking, listening to music, and out of nowhere, you just start hearing human screaming, like, ah, like blood curdling scream, right? 
and you hear it through the music. And I pause the music. I was like, "Where did you hear that?" And we're waiting. And we just hear like screaming, barking. And we're like, oh, "Okay, maybe it's like." At first, I'm like, "I thought someone was getting attacked." Right? I was like, "Damn, someone is getting ripped up to shreds right now," and that is crazy work, right? And we was like, "Oh, like the dogs barking is probably just like the machine, right?" But then we start thinking about like, we were just there, but we didn't see anybody. Like, there's no one around us, you know. It was you know, Futari, just us two, just us two there in that area. In the area, it's keep in mind, it's 11:30 at this point, p.m. Pitch black. You need like a flashlight. And so we're in. We're like, no way. Like, we're the only two people in the area. We didn't see anyone walking. There's no one biking, and so we're like, holy shit. There was a bear near us down that path that activated that machine. And, you know, even though we were playing music and like ringing our bells, that bear still came after us. <laughs> if you think about it that way, right? That bear actively pursued us as we were leaving. And it's not like we were like, oh, I don't know, like five meters away from the bear, like the bear was chasing us, right? But the thought of, wow, this bear could have potentially killed us and was like kind of following us as we were leaving because we we're like, oh, I got a bad feeling, you know? It was like, oh, my body senses are tingling, but we we're like, oh, it's kind of scary, kind of like, you know, we're both superstitious, and we're like, mm, bad, bad mojo, bad jojo, you know what I mean? Bad mojo. Let's just go home, right? Let's just go home. We only had one and a half kilometers left, but it was like all through the forest to the camping ground. And so we're like, all right, fuck it, let's just go home. And so we really think it was just a bear that was like behind us, and we was like, holy shit, like that's so terrifying. And it was so funny because we were biking earlier, and we were like, all right, bro, let's make a pack. If there's a bear and it gets one of us, we just bike it away. Like, I ain't helping you. I mean, I agree, you know what I mean? But it was just terrifying to think of, you know, what if we did continue biking down that path? We could have got jumped by a pack of bears, you know what I mean? A group of bears, a gang of bears. Because that machine, like, there's no way it just goes off on any, you know, motion. Like a squirrel, a rock move, I don't know, a leaf, a bird. And it seems like it's weight-based. Like, like, you need, like, I don't know, X amount of weight to activate it, right? You know, it's like humans on a bike, like, it's pretty heavy. And so, we're biking away, and we're like, oh my god, like, bro, we just had a bear pursue us. You know, we're actively sweating. Well, apparently has food in his bag. I don't know when he said, like, he had, like, raw meat in his bag, if you like, so for real, but, um, potentially, right? We had a bear kind of chase us not chase us like you know like not oh i turn around i see the bear chasing me right but i think like when we were crossing that bridge i think the bear was like starting to make its way towards us so i just think it's like damn that, that is crazy very scary um and then we were biking like super duper fast and we we're just like kind of shook up because we're like holy shit and then we went to suda hall will bought some ramen and we saw like a police like that's night security and we're like oh no it's me man oh no oh no sports complex no coin day oh no come on and he was like okay well i don't know why you're telling me like go fill in the report and we're like oh okay it was really funny because <laughs> after that we're like damn nobody did not care he was like what am i gonna do kill it so that's kind of like our bear encounter i think it was kind of scary to think about damn we kind of had a bear like follow us because it really was just us two in the entire vicinity of the park there's nobody there right there's no bikers there's no people and if we are going based off of, like our idea of weight based we had something heavy enough to follow us so that's like dang it's a little nerve-wracking but i got home i showered i went to the library for a little bit i finished summer and i's presentation for history i fixed the video i finished the video snippet i'm ready to present but I am going to receive a little notebook from Maddie that I gave to Maddie. Um, I kind of need a bag, sorry Maddie, uh, because I want to write letters to some people I care about a lot from AIU. It's not that I don't care about everyone that I met at AIU. I'd love to give a handwritten letter to everyone I met at AIU, but it's just you know, kind of like hard to write to every single person I've ever met at AIU. So um, please don't take any offense to select new people who get a letter from me, but um, yeah, I'm gonna go brush my teeth and go to bed. So I'll see you in the morning. Bye bye.